Yeah, the NL wild card is a, is a doozy. You got you know pretty much seven teams, eight teams right there. Right now, the Diamondbacks are reeling. They've lost four in a row. They have a very tough schedule. They play just about contenders the rest of the way uh, beginning on Thursday. Uh, tough road. St. Louis has been on fire under Mike Schilt, the interim manager. Brewers playing great. Cubs on fire. I don't think it's going to come, anything come from the uh, NL East, not with the uh, Phillies and Braves, you know, just kind of treading water right now. So the way it looks right now, I, uh, I think it's going to be the two teams from the Central. I think the uh, Brewers and uh, St. Louis Cardinals look like they'll be the teams facing one another, barring something in the West. I mean, the Dodgers, you know, are, are playing great baseball again. And Colorado's still hanging around. I mean, Colorado's in first place. Just nobody talks about them. Yeah, I think it's almost set, set in stone. You know, it's Yankees and uh, Oakland A's. Uh, yeah, I mean, Oakland A's still have a chance to win the division. Just, you know, but I don't see Houston uh, Houston giving that thing up. They got two and a half game lead. They're a better team. Uh, question is, will they give me play in Oakland or at Yankee Stadium? If it's Oakland, that's giving me a lot of trouble for uh, the Yankees. I mean, it's going to be trouble enough as it is. Uh, so Oakland's got a lot of firepower. They can throw up, you know, six different quality relievers at you. Uh, and I, I just don't see Seattle overcoming Oakland. I, I think the wild guard field is set, and, and Yankees are too far back of Boston to catch them.